everybody what's up it's kiki and i am coming to you guys today with a look at this wig that i am rocking this is one of the newer summer spring summer wigs from rpg show and it's also from their higher density line so i'm going to show you guys how i took this wig from not so hot to the hotness that you see in front of you right now with the natural looking part and everything so if you want to see how i do that continue to watch so to start off, I'm going to give you all the specs of this wig. It is a 200% density lace front wig. And it is wavy, actually. When I washed this hair, it did have a slight little wave to it, but nothing like super wavy. I didn't choose the hair color. It was the same as the picture on the website. The hair length I have is 20 inches, but it does seem a lot longer. Like, I really think it's like 22 inches. The hair texture I have is silky. It's a non yakky texture. The lace color is a light brown. And the cap construction is a cap 4 lace front wig cap. And the cap size is a size 1. So straight out of the package, you can see that the wig wasn't really styled. But that's not an issue. Every time you get a wig, it's not going to be perfectly styled for you. So you will have to do some styling to it yourself. So you might have to shampoo it, condition it, repart it to where you like your part. Like I like my parts on the right side. So that's what I did. I switched it over to a right side part. And I also thought about giving it full bangs. But I went ahead and just kept it with the side part. Also, I wanted to let you guys know that the parting on the wig is so much. They give you quite a bit of lace in the front to give you a whole lot of parting room. I'm not sure if all RPG show wigs are like this now, but you can definitely tell they've been listening to us. They took that center comb out the middle and actually put it in the back of the wig. So that is a plus. So I'm just going to put the wig on. Like I said, I did shampoo it and condition it, parted it the way I wanted it to part and let it air dry. I pre-parted the hair while it was wet so that the part could dry flat. And now I'm just going to take a concealer a little bit lighter than my skin tone and carve out the parting so that it looks more natural because I am wearing a black stocking cap because I can never find the perfect nude for my skin tone. As you can see, I'm bringing the concealer around the hairline to give it like a natural parting to make it look more natural in the front so what I do is pull a little bit of hair from the front of the hairline just to give it like an edges kind of look or baby hair but not really all I want to do is have this hair blend in with my hair because my hair isn't you know of a fuller density so I just want this hair to blend in with my hair and then I take a razor comb and cut that off and then I use a little bit of the Gorilla Glue or Gorilla Snot, not Gorilla Glue, don't use Gorilla Glue. Gorilla Snot as a little bit of edge control and to hold down the hair and it works perfectly and it holds all day. And then I'm gonna add a few layers in the hair just so it's not so weighted because this is some thick hair compared to any other RPG show wig I've ever gotten. Like this hair is so full and dense. I need the layers just so the hair doesn't look so weighed down. And then I'm gonna take my Big Remington Curling One, Remington. You guys remember when we first really started using Curling Ones, Remington was the go-to. This, this is the bigger one of the Remington, but yeah, this is so nostalgic. It brings back so many memories of back in the day on YouTube. A whole lot has changed since then, but yeah. And I'm using a big curling one because I want a wave and not a curl. And I'm curling inward instead of outward because I want the waves to come towards my face. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit of frizz ease to my hair so that it doesn't get frizzy. And that is all. I really, really like this hair. I do get a little bit of snagging when it rubs up against my shirt. No shedding or anything like that. And as you can see, the ends on the hair is really, really nice. And the hair is just really, really nice all over. It may look a little brassy on camera because my lighting is all messed up. As you guys could tell from the different clips, the lighting was just off. But I think they did a really good job on the coloring. So make sure you guys check out RPG Show. I have all the information in the description box. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.